Welcome to the Great Exodus series, God's plan of rescue for his children. Let my people go, the path to Mount Zion. My name is Michael, I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. And our topic today is, do you hear the call? God is calling you forth right now to walk that path. And he is calling you forth to become the bride. He is knocking at your door and you have to answer. Answer that call right now. Do not give in to the enemy or to the world or its temptation. Come out of the world and out of Babylon. Walk that narrow and righteous path towards Mount Zion where we, where we will be all ruptured into paradise at the sixth seal. Mount Zion and Jesus and the Father is coming down at the sixth seal with Mount Zion. And you and all the people who are closed and white, the multitude closed and white, will be ruptured into paradise. And the ones that are the 144,000 will be sealed at that time. Now you are called for us to fulfill your destiny and purpose on us, to build the dwelling places of Zion in your home, in your neighborhood. Step forward now. Gather the people together. The people that will come to your dwelling places are the children of Zion. These are the chosen people that God will direct you to your places and you will train them and you will teach them and you will empower them. And then when they are trained and fully filled with the Holy Spirit and when they are walking in spirit and truth, then you will send them out onto the righteous path and you will send them out into the neighborhoods and they will bring in the harvest of the ages. They will gather in the wheat into the barn. Now the call is going forth. Now you have to awake. The, the bell is ringing now and you have to come forward. The alarm is ringing. Don't shut it off and go back to slumber. Now you have to come forth. Stand up now. Stand up as Michael is standing up in Daniel 12.1. Michael will stand up and me, I am Michael, I also will stand up. Standing up now to build the dwelling places of Zion and you will build one too. If you do not know how to, we have a training session in our training academy. Go into the pinned comment and follow the link to Eventbrite. There you see that we have a training. A training to become an elder and to establish a society of the rose, a dwelling place of Zion in your home. Sign up. Be part of it. The training will start on the 15th of December. And you can sign up for the event until the 10th of December. So now is the time to step forward. Now is the time to hear the call, the calling from the Lord. Your calling now. Start your ministry, your dwelling place of Zion in your neighborhood and in your homes and gather the people together. Come together in love, unity and support and bring in the harvest of the ages, the multitude closed and white. Be separated from the world so that God can protect you and put a covering over you. But if you stay in the world, he cannot do that. You have to come out of the world and out of Babylon. If you have a lot of questions, you do not know how to do all this, then send us an email to our ministry at triplegrace55 at gmail.com and we will help you step by step. Be part of the training to become an elder and establish a dwelling place of Zion in your home. Sign up for it. The link is in the pinned comments. You can also help the ministry to spread to the whole world so that we have more subscribers and more people that will listen to the messages by sowing into our ministry. The links are in the description box below. So help us. Do something. Come forth. Assist the children. Help us in our mission to Cambodia. Help us in the ways that the Lord has set in front of us and in front of you too. Walk the narrow path, not the broad path, not the path of the world. Come out of the world. Leave that big ship and enter your own small ship. Because the big ship will go down in the storm. But the small ships will be all protected by the Lord. Create love in your environment. Create the rose that the rose will blossom in your home and in your neighborhood. Create that rose because the Lord wants that thousands of roses will bloom in all the nations. And each and every rose he will cover with a shield that nothing will harm them. And the enemy will never see or find you because you will be protected. For the enemy, for the world, you have vanished. 
but for God you have entered the heavenly kingdom. Thank you that you listened to this topic today and I hope you sign up for the event to be trained as an elder, a certified elder and to establish a dwelling place in your home. Help us in the ministry, support us, assist us, make a few donations for the children in our mission to Cambodia or help us in the ministry direct. No matter what, we are so grateful for everybody who comes forth to assist us. Thank you. I send you all my love and the love of the Father. Praise Jesus. Praise God Almighty. Forever and ever. Have a blessed day. Maranatha.